Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Dokken Metal video. In this video we are going to be taking a look at the performance of the physical Super Saiyan 3 Goku Angel and just how good he is after, well, his Extreme Z Awakening that got released on DBZ Dokken Metal Global. So you can easy A this guy by accessing him from uh, the Bubba Shop and you can trade in medals to easy A him. Overall, uh, he looks okay. Uh, honestly speaking, I think he's probably just best for SBR and ESBR. He's got a lot of good stuff here, it just seems very low in terms of numbers. Uh, I like the build, I just don't necessarily like the output, if that makes sense. He's a strength and physical type. Key plus 3 HP attack and defense is 70% lead. He raises attack and defense for one turn and causes supreme damage with a medium chance of stunning the enemy. He has key plus 3 and attack and defense of 100% at the start of turn, plus an additional attack and defense of 50% when performing a super attack, an additional defense of 50% when HP is 50% or more, an additional attack of 50% when performing a super attack, and a high chance of performing a critical hit and launching an additional attack that has a medium chance of becoming a super attack for 5 turns from the start of turn. Because of the crit hit, because of the medium chance to stun, because of the 5 turn factor, I think this guy is very much best used for SBR and ESBR, but overall he looks like an interesting pick. Uh, basically, he has an overall attack or defense boost of 274% when his super hit, when his health is above it, yeah, 50%. And being a Super Saiyan 3 unit, he is very much geared towards Super Saiyan 3 units in terms of linking. Golden Warrior, Super Saiyan, Saiyan Lineage, Over in a Flash, Limit Breaking Form, Revival, and Fierce Battle. In terms of categories, got Resurrected Warriors, Martian Buu Saga, Super Saiyan 3, Pure Saiyans, Movie Heroes, Goku's Family, Otherworld Warriors, Turtle School, Master Devolution, Bond of Friendship, Accelerated Battle, Power Beyond Super Saiyans, Bond of Parent and Child, and Earthbred Fighters. So, some pretty good stuff. Overall, uh, his you know, performance is okay. Uh, honestly, the numbers, as I mentioned, don't really excite me. I think that kit build is very, very good uh, overall. Yeah, it's really, 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 really good. So, I think his like build, his actual passives, his abilities, and everything like that, barring the actual numbers themselves, is good. Um, you know, the additional 50% attack and defense when attacking I think is very good. The, you know, high chance of performing a critical hit is very good and launches an additional attack that has a medium chance of becoming a super is very solid. I think his ability to stun is good, but it just feels like he is behind in terms of numbers. And it's a bit strange, of course, because I obviously added in his EZA now. So, I don't really know why they're so low. They needed to be tweaked, like, a little bit. Just, like, 50% more, and probably would be happy with them. You know, 3.7 million instead of 2.5. 130k defense instead of 99k. Just a little bit would have been pretty good. Because the build for him is pretty simple. Like, you're just going to build him full additional. That's going to enable him to be super strong for those first five turns. He'll be firing off, you know, three super attacks. Uh, he'll be raising his defense on all of those. All of them will have a 50% crit chance. Uh, they'll have a medium chance to stun. So he's a great second slot from that perspective. Like, he's really good in terms of design for SBR and ESBR. I got nothing wrong with his design from that perspective. There's no ways in hell he'll go into a red zone. But he's a very solid SBR kind of unit, and I don't have a problem with them making those, but the problem is, is that his numbers just are a little bit low. Uh, I think they could have tweaked them a little bit more, especially considering how much effort it takes between the Kai's and the grinding, because you can't, you know, like, either you use Kai's or you have to buy a thousand copies of them, which costs a lot of gems. Like, I bought the copies of them to, you know, cover his SA and it cost me a lot I think it cost me like 9,000 green gems or something which is a lot of grinding like that was I even had to trade in blue gems for it so 
I think they could have made them a little bit better, uh, at least from my perspective. Here we can see, uh, you know, 99k defense, that's not good. Um, it's not bad, remember it goes up a lot when he supers. Um, it'll go up quite a bit, it will be like 200k. Like it's not, the 99 is a bit misleading, it, it will be quite substantially higher than that. Um, it'll be around 200k. And then when he obviously hits his super, it'll be around 220 I believe. So it's not, like when I say it's, you know, it's not bad, he's a second slot unit for sure. 3.7 million, also pretty solid as well. And so, honestly speaking, like, it's not like he's terrible. Like I said, just feels like he could have been a li beefed up a little bit. Just beefed up like a little bit. Just a tiny tad more improved is all. You know, that's, that's, that's my major thing. Just a tiny little bit improved. Uh, would be ideal for me and then you know from there we would look pretty good so obviously in terms of his links and everything uh, I think it's pretty self-explanatory he's really good when he links up with Super Saiyan 3 units uh, that's kind of his MO you know that's really where his link set is built he's got Super Saiyan, Golden Warrior, um, Saiyan Lineage all these uh, I think is, yeah, pretty solid. Um, I think in general it's it's really quite straightforward. Um, fierce battles, super common. Uh, Saiyan lineage, decent key link, bit of attack, bit of defense. Super Saiyan, bit of attack. Golden Warrior, bit of a key. Um, and then he's got over in the flash and limit breaking form. More Super Saiyan 3 orientated. He doesn't gain a lot from Lynx, he gains attack mostly, which is fine, um, it's really fine to give him attack, but they don't do much, it's not, again, super units are not, never really like, um, you know, super units are never like extreme units, or a lot of them aren't, where like their Lynx set's gonna give them a lot, you get a few, like the Defenders of Justice units that gain a very large amount from their Lynx sets, but I don't think there's a ton that gain a huge amount of traction from their link set. So yeah, beyond that though, everything's fine. I think in general, it all looks pretty good. Uh, link set's fairly consistent. Obviously he's designed for Super Saiyan 3 team. I think he's basically been designed to help with the Super Saiyan 3, you know, SBR and ESBR. I, I think that's clearly where he's designed to be utilized. And I think that's okay, you know, him being designed specifically for one stage is more than fine. Uh, it's not really a major issue. So yeah, I think overall he looks pretty good. I, I for one, am happy with him. I think he looks great. And yeah, overall, I'm pretty happy with his performance. I think in general, he just looks solid. Uh, with that being said, obviously, yeah, there's not too much else more to say. Is he crazy not really uh he's good for sbr and esbr and that's about it but that's okay uh so if you are interested in completing those stages i would then suggest getting him however if you don't need to do those stages if you've done them already uh then there's not there's not a lot of reason to get him then for anything else he's not going to help you with red zone uh he's He's fun to use for some events. Uh, he may help you out, obviously, in future with other events as well. But in general, I think this is just kind of, yeah. You need him for SBR and the SBR. And if you don't, then that's about it. But yeah, that's basically it for me. Uh, I think that covers everything we need to cover in regards to him as a unit. So I want to hear what you guys think in the comments. And I will see you guys in the next one. So until then, take care, stay safe, and bye.